Allah says in the Quran, quoting the people of Jannah, وَنَادَى أَصْحَابُ الْجَنَّةِ أَصْحَابَ النَّارِ أَنْ قَدْ, وج- أن قد وَجَدْنَا مَا وَعَدَنَا رَبُّنَا حَقَّا فَهَلْ وَجَدْتُمْ مَا وَعَدَ رَبُّكُمْ حَقَّا Allah says, and the people of Jannah shall call out to the people of the fire. And they will actually say to them, أَنْ قَدْ وَجَدْنَا مَا وَعَدَنَا رَبُّنَا حَقَّا That indeed we have found the promise of our Lord to be true. فَهَلْ وَجَدْتُمْ مَا وَعَدَ رَبُّكُمْ حَقَّا So have you found the promise of your Lord to be true? قَالُوا نَعْمْ They will reply in the affirmative. And even that shaytan, that great deceiver, as Allah says, O oh people, know that the promise of Allah is true haqq. Therefore do not let the worldly life deceive you. And do not let the great deceiver deceive you. Because shaitan, being such an iblis, on Yawm al-Qiyamah, as Allah quotes, Allah says, وَقَالَ الشَّيْطَانُ لَمَّا قُضِيَ الْأَمْرِ And shaitan will say, when the matter will be decreed in the hereafter, إِنَّ اللَّهَ وَعَدَكُمْ وَعَدَ الْحَقِّ وَوَعَدْتُكُمْ That indeed Allah promised you a promise of truth, and I also promised you. So even shaitan will tell us then, that I made you a promise, Allah made you a promise. But Allah's promise was a true promise. Inna Allah wa'adakum wa'ad al Indeed, Allah promised you a true promise, a promise of truth. Wa'adtukum. And I also promised you. Fa'akhliftukum. But I reneged on my promise to you. وَمَا كَانَ لِيَ عَلَيْكُمْ مِنْ سُلْطَانِ and I had no power over you, illa an da'awtukum, except that I invited you. So we will have no defense that shaitan made me do this. Shaitan compelled me to do this. Shaitan inci- incited me to do this. Yes, shaitan has huge forces at his disposal in order to fulfill his promise to Allah and his promise to us. And his promise to us was... I will surely mislead them, misguide them, lead them astray, deceive them, give them hope, promises. I will instruct them to sin. All of these are from the Quran. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, in response, when he made that promise to Allah that I will do all of this, what did Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala say to him? Fine. وَاسْتَفْزِزْ مَنْ اسْتَطَعْتَ مِنْهُمْ بِصَوْتِكَ وَأَجْلِبْ عَلَيْهِمْ بِخَيْلِكْ وَرَجِلِكْ وَشَارِكْهُمْ فِي الْأَمْوَالِ وَالْأَوْلَادِ وَعِدْهُمْ وَمَا يَعِدُهُمُ الشَّيْطَانُ إِلَّا غُرُورًا Allah says, in that case, وَاسْتَفْزِزْ مَنِ اسْتَطَعْتْ مِنْهُمْ بِصَوْتِكْ Arouse from mankind whomever you can with your voice. وَأَجْلِبْ عَلَيْهِمْ بِخَيْلِكْ وَرَجِلِكْ And amass against them. Amass and draw against them. Your khayl and your rajil. Do you know what that means? Your khayl and your rajil. Bikhaylik wa rajilik. Your khayl, your infantry. Sorry, your cavalry. Wa rajilik and your infantry. Khayl means cavalry. Rajil means infantry. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told shaitan, fine, you're going to, you're going, you promise to mislead them, do this against them. You promise to claim a share of my, no, of my servants. Then fine. Do what you can. Arouse whomever you can of them with your voice. And amass against them. Gather against them your cavalry and your infantry. And be a partner with them in their wealth and in their children. Allahu Akbar. Shaitan can be a partner not only in our wealth, but in our children. By the words of the Quran. And then Allah says, وَعِدْهُمْ and promise them. وَمَا يَعِدُهُمُ الشَّيْطَانُ إِلَّا غُرُورًا And shaitan does not promise them anything except deception. These are all the promises of shaitan. So he makes so many promises. And on Yawm Al-Qiyamah, he will actually confess and say, Allah promised you a promise of truth. And I also promised you. وَمَا كَانَ لِي عَلَيْكُمْ مِنْ سلطان. And I did not have any power over you. So despite his forces of infantry and cavalry, and his allurement and his arousing voice, despite all of this, he will say rightfully that 
that I wasn't able to compel you to do anything. I merely, وَمَا كَانَ لِيَ عَلَيْكُمْ مِنْ سُلْطَانَ I had no power over you, إِلَّا أَنْ دَعَوْتُكُمْ Except that I invited you. فَاسْتَجَبْتُمْ فَاسْتَجَبْتُمْ لِي So you accepted my invitation. فَلَا تَلُومُونِ So do not blame me. وَلُومُ أَنْفُسَكُمْ Rather blame yourself. ما أنا بمسرخكم وما أنتم بمسرخي. I cannot save you this day, and nor can you save me. And then Shaytan will turn against himself, meaning everything that he did. There are other verses of the Holy Quran as well, which speak about this promise of Allah and this promise of Shaytan. In short, Allah Subhanahu wa Taala promises his forgiveness, maghfirah. And the Akhirah. And Shaitan promises us the dunya. And all that we seek in this world. Through wealth, through fame, through other things. Shaitan's promise is a false one. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's promise is a promise of truth. And Allah tells us repeatedly, do not let the worldly life deceive you. Allah's promise is true, do not let the worldly life deceive you or the great deceiver deceive you. 